Today is going to be a brutal day on me. Actually, the last three weeks have been pretty brutal, even during my vacation. I went to the dentist three weeks ago to get my quarterly cleaning and then had a cavity filled. And apparently, either he drilled too deep or there was moisture oh, contained. Yeah. I'm in a lot of pain. And I'm going to see if he can do this. I, uh, it hurts to touch it. And he removed that one like 10 years ago because he just needed removing. <laughs> yeah, I, but this one hurts. So I am bringing my son with me to for a little moral support. Fingers across, he doesn't crack my jaw. Okay, now I'm going to go pick up my antibiotics. That's right, I take a whole bunch of amoxicillin before I do any dental work because, you know, I got fake hips. <laughs> I'm nervous. Okay, so in half an hour, I'm going to be missing a tooth. That line. Get ready to take my tooth. Yeah, that's the last time I'm gonna see it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> In my head. I brought the rug rat and I'm getting ready to have the tooth removed. I just got my shot. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. I gotta drive back home now. Ah, uh, it hurts. Ah, <laughs> uh, gotta take it out. Got a lot of blood. Gotta do. Oh, uh, uh, it's gone. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, I got to hold this there for a bit until it quits bleeding, supposedly, I guess. And I can't drink anything through a straw or eat any food for like 72 hours. It's all liquids. Ugh. All in all, I guess it wasn't really that bad once it gave me all those shots. <laughs> it only took a few seconds. And my dentist, well... You know, I guess he felt bad about the fact that, <laughs> I'm sorry, he felt bad about the fact that I'd been in pain and due to getting the feeling, so he did it for no charge. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> Oh, okay, day five. I'm finally feeling normal. I can touch my face. Yes, I am missing a tooth. And yes, <laughs> you know, I have been, you know, brushing my teeth twice a day and flossing twice a day and going to the dentist every three months to get a cleaning and this filling. Unfortunately, just was not in my best interest aside from the cost of it. It cost me my tooth. That's right, folks. A filling can sometimes lead to an extraction. So if you get a filling and you notice that your pain is worse <laughs> and it's getting worse daily, odds are pretty good you need to go back to your dentist. And, you know, it, it's rare, but indeed sometimes a filling, you know, when it's done, it, it gets too high or something and then it's touching the nerve and, and you've got a choice. You can have your tooth removed or you can get a root canal. And at this point, I just wasn't going to invest in a root canal. <laughs> that's, you know, that's uh, way too much money for me. Um, it was much easier just to get the tooth removed and Fortunately, my dentist did not charge me to remove my tooth. 
that would have been like adding insult to injury as far as I'm concerned because I'm a hairdresser, you know, and if I chop off somebody's hair, I'm not going to charge them double for the wig, <laughs> especially if it was, you know, not planned. Uh, no, seriously, uh, my dentist, he did good. And I'm missing a tooth, but my wallet, it's not missing any more money, so... <laughs> Oh, yeah, folks, I made this video so that you can be aware of the fact that regardless of how good you take care of your teeth, sometimes a filling can lead to an extraction, and if you're in any pain after you get a filling and you notice as the days go by that the pain is getting worse, <laughs> Odds are pretty good. You need to get back to your dentist and just let them know, hey, this is not good. <laughs> now, my dentist, he's put up with me for like, God, over 10 years now. And he's done some great work, actually. But this last time, yeah, it led to an extraction. But at least it's the back tooth and you can't really see it. But, uh uh, <laughs> it still feels weird. <sighs> the older I get, the more things I need to have replaced, <laughs> removed, replaced. <laughs> so I got a couple more days now before I, I guess, can uh, eat something crunchy. Because, you know, I don't want to get it up in, in there. Open wound. And... Uh, a few more days before I can suck on something. <laughs> Don't want dry socket. <laughs> yeah, I'm still tender, but at least it's over with, you know. <laughs> the pain is gone. Tooth gone, pain gone. <laughs> well, thanks for joining me on my tooth extraction adventure. Hopefully, you yourself will not have to encounter an extraction due to getting a filling. <laughs>